Well, we'll keep an eye on that. Meanwhile, it's been a tough year for students as they deal with not only changes at school because of this pandemic, but also racial unrest and, of course, that election. That's why one local school district is dedicating a day away from schoolwork so they can focus on their mental health. News 5's Jay Jarvis explains how that would work and what parents think of it. 2020 has made it hard for kids to just be kids. They're both very concerned about the pandemic. Melanie Vance's daughter Victoria and son Lincoln go to Barberton High School. Victoria is learning remotely this year while Lincoln goes in person five days a week, but they have much more on their minds than just school work. I work at the hospital, I'm a local bartender, so it affects our lives every day. And Vance says, like many other teenagers, it's not always easy getting them to open up. Mine are very uh, introverted, so you don't really, you can't see what they're feeling on the outside. That's why she's thrilled Barberton Schools announced it's pausing normal classes next Friday so students can stay home and learn how to cope with their stress and anxiety through remote sessions with mental health experts. From the pandemic, from the election, from the racial unrest, I mean, there's just a lot going on right now. Superintendent Jeff Ramnett says after speaking with parents, students, and staff members about rising stress levels, he and other administrators came up with the idea, enlisting the services of four local mental health organizations. I can't see everybody's faces, but I can see their eyes. And I've been doing this for 31 years, and I have an idea when when the staff is, is getting to a point or when the students are getting to that point. Staff members will also receive training on how to better support themselves and students. We're hoping even the parents, you know, log on with them. I hope that most families take advantage of it. Crystal Allen has three kids in the district. She says she applauds administrators for considering students' needs beyond the classroom. I think the school really does take into account how the kids are feeling about all situations that they they're put into as the year goes on. So I think it's a great plan. Jade Jarvis, News 5. So our kids aren't the only ones feeling a little stressed.